Now, where were you when you found out that you were nominated for a Grammy? Where was I? Um, in my house. Half-dressed, I was. We... Trust my fate to the winds. Welcome back to Crazy Zingham, my name is Mark. Today we have a video on the legend Lemmy. No one can put as much rock and roll into their voices as he was able to do. In fact, I found this very interesting random short while browsing YouTube of someone impersonating Lemmy's voice. I don't say you agree. The only gun I need is the ice of spades. And it is incredibly interesting because somehow hearing Lemmy's technique in someone else's voice really helps you put into perspective how insane his vocal tone really is. Because when you hear him do it, it sounds natural, you're used to it, it is effortless, it is great, so it's just, oh yeah, that's Lemmy. When you hear someone else do it, it's like, holy shit, those vocals are so goddamn distorted. <laughs> how did he not lose his voice after singing two songs. I don't say you greed. The only god I need is the ace of spades. The ace of spades. You could say his voice has as much distortion as his bass tone, which is saying a lot. The difference is that most bass players sound like this. Whereas I... Sound quite different. And from this track comes spot number six from this list of his most impossible vocals, and it's quite a high note, the C sharp being sung in the world forever. And it sounds incredible. You know I'm born to lose and gambling's for fools, but that's the way I like it, baby. I don't wanna live forever. And this tone can get even crazier in some live shows that I've found, like this one, which is spot number five. And this next live scream from 2004 might be even more extreme. It sounds incredible. But these screams keep getting higher. But the thing is, the highest one he has ever sung, we can't hear it that much because it's sort of hidden at the end of the track, Kill by Death. For some reason, you know, the audio fades out, the volume fades out, and we can't hear it that much, but it's there, and we can hear just about enough to tell it sounds incredible. And there's also this amazing vocal line, which is sung beautifully in Riding with the Driver, and it goes so incredibly high, it's crazy how difficult it gets to enunciate words. But one of my favorite screams I found while researching Lemmy is at the end of the song, the chase is better than the catch. Man, I want to sound like Lemmy. How does he do it though? The aces, the aces, Bates. You sound fucking weak. Mom? <laughs> 